Hello friends, welcome to my channel Civil Engineering Forum. In this video, I am going to talk about my reviews on which floor should we go for if we are buying an apartment. I have prepared this video for those people who are planning to buy apartment. They should know the factors which may affect on the level of the floor. It is definitely upon the choice of the owner to decide the number of floor he wants to live on. But here we are discussing some technical points on which floor is practically feasible to have maximum comfort. Now according to the first priority we should avoid the top floor. This is because according to civil and structural engineers there are most chances of water leakage through ceilings of the top floor due to the seepage of rainwater or overhead water tank. That is our first problem will be ceiling water leakage. And secondary, it would be but, but obvious that the top floor will remain slightly warm as compared to all other floors as the surface area covered by the sunlight that directly falls on it is greater and the top slab will always be exposed to the external environment. So our next issue will be warming issue. Then our third point is water pressure problem. This is what people experience who are living in high rise apartment that water pressure on higher floors is lower than it is on the lower floors. This is due to the potential energy stored in water increases with the increase in the vertical height of the pipeline from overhead water tank. Then the most common problem experienced by people living on the higher floors will be our fourth point that is we cannot manage without lift if we are living on the top floors. We will not be able to take stairs every now and then in case of the lift breakdown. So these are few reasons for which we should not go for the top floor. Now the next is why shouldn't we go for ground floor or first floor in any apartment. So again there are few points that should be in our mind before taking the decision. So our first point is noise pollution by vehicles and people. It is obvious that children's playing game, making noise, parties, function and vehicles will create undesirable noise and would be disturbing for the people living at the bottom floors. Then after, there are privacy issues. Everyone entering and leaving the apartment lift would have to go through the bottom floors which might affect the privacy of the people living there. Then drainage overflow. This is an issue which people who live in on the level which is equal to or lower than the road level. Overflowing of drainage though it is rare but worth considering point. Then the fourth point is mosquitoes problem. Due to grimmers and earth or we would say soil, outside mosquitoes always be the greatest bug for the human being. Sometimes on the lower floors it would not allow us to open the window. And the last point for which we should not buy the apartment on the ground floor is cannot enjoy balcony. People living on the ground floors will not get balcony while people living on the first floor will not enjoy the view and ventilation of the balcony as compared to the higher floors even though they have got one. Then an obvious question which may arise in your mind is then which floor should we go for and why? So I have got some points to discuss regarding that. Now at first according to me we should prefer third floor. This is because we can manage without lift in case of breakdown, climbing up to third floor would not be that difficult. Secondary, we will get sufficient ventilation. Compared to higher floors, it would be low, but at third floor level, we might get the sufficient ventilation. Then on the third floor, the problem which we discussed for ground, first and top floor can be avoided. And one of them was mosquitoes problem can be avoided. Mosquitoes will be comparatively less on the third floor as it is on the sufficient height. So this was all about choosing of the floor level before buying an apartment. Thank you for watching.